Hello everyone, this is COADB.com or the Coat of Arms database and today we are briefly going to discuss several different coats of arms in the Roth family. Now there are 20 in the presentation and we have many more in our database. We don't have time to cover all of them unfortunately. The first is Ghouls on a Chevron Ermine 3 Mullets Sable. This was associated with a Roth individual or family from Leicestershire, England. And that's all the information I was able to find on this one. If you know more, please let us know in the comments. Next, Ghouls and Orly Ermine in a Chief, a label Azure. This from the British Isles, likely related to the previous one based on the tinctures or colors. Next, one from Denmark. It says here the family was ennobled in 1471. Features an ibex pierced with an arrow. Another, this is for the Roths of Kilkenny, Ireland. An ancient family that descended from John Fitzwilliam Roth of Northern Roth in Lancashire, England, who went to Ireland in the 12th century. The family had their chief residences at Bally Rotten and Tullow, Maine. Sir Robert Roth earned his fame as a trusted legal advisor to Thomas Butler, and he was also Kilkenny's first mayor after 1609. A branch of the family settled in New Ross County, Wexford, Ireland, and they descended from John Roth, Esquire of Ballyvan, who died in the year 1585. Here we see the family tomb and the family home. Another from Kilkenny, Ireland, slightly different coloring. Another from Holland. This from Roth of Amsterdam. This was the coat of arms of Reinhold Roth, born 1623, a captain in the Danish army, son of Hieronymus Roth, a merchant and mayor of Nipoff. And Reinhold had nine children, many of whom lived in Amsterdam. Here we see a rendition of the coat of arms. Another coat of arms, this also from Amsterdam. I believe this to be the arms of the family of Johannes Roth of Amsterdam, born 1628, Lord of Oud, Wolven, and Weyen in the Netherlands. He was a prophetic preacher, the son of Zacharias Roth, a sugar merchant, and administrator in the Dutch East India Company. He was once imprisoned by Oliver Cromwell because his sermons were seen as a plea for the return of King Charles II of England. After his release, he traveled to Denmark and Prussia before returning to England in 1660. And here he is depicted. At the time, Charles had been restored to the crown. He rewarded his supporters, including Roth, and it says here who was elevated to the peerage, although I wasn't able to find any evidence of that, and I didn't spend too much time looking into that. The family is said to descend from present-day Kaliningrad in Russia. Here we see the castle of Ud Wolven. And the family arms depicted on the entrance gate of the castle. Next, a coat of arms for the Roths of Bavaria. I believe it was granted to Hans Roth by Kaiser Rudolf II on November 5th, 1557. Another for Johann Roth, he was an honorary military captain who was ennobled in Bavaria on April 27, 1811. 
Another coat of arms, this of Moritz Conrad Roth, a cavalry officer who was ennobled in Prussia in 1701. Next, we have Roth de Schreckstein from Baden and Prussia. Nobility was confirmed to the family in 1552. It is said that they descended from a patrician family from Ulm and Augsburg. Of this lineage was Hans Jakob von Roth, born 1580, described as an Oberlandmeister. I'm not sure what that is, unfortunately. Um, and also of this family was Ludwig Freiherr von Roth, or Roth von Schreckenstein, who died in 1858. He was a Prussian general of the cavalry and a minister of war. And here we see Ludwig, his depiction. And here he is again. Next, a coat of arms from Thuringia in Germany. I believe it is similar to a coat of arms worn by the family that included Major Anton von Roth and his brother, Lieutenant Ernest Heinrich von Roth, who lived in the 18th century. Another for Roth de Rutzen of Silesia. Nobility was confirmed in 1678 to Captain Johann Wilhelm Roth and Wilhelm Moritz von Roth, captain of an infantry regiment, was elevated to the status of baron in 1721, as were his four brothers several years later. The brothers were Johann Friedrich, Adam Wenzel, Karl Gustav, and Ferdinand von Roth. The next is for the Roths of Mersein of Silesia. Jacob Ernest von Roth was ennobled in 1654, and Friedrich von Roth was ennobled in 1671. Next, we have Roth de Teledged of Transylvania, who were ennobled in 1649. Of this family was Karl Roth von Teledged, a, who was a city councilor in the year 1837. Roth de Rohrbach. Not sure about too much on this one, but there were there was a Johann Friedrich Roth von Rohrbach, born in 1688, who had son Johann Jakob, born 1648. And that's off. Um, but they were they lived in the let's say 17th century, and they, he also had a grandson named August. And we have one from Basel, Switzerland, featuring a rose. And if you enjoyed this video and would like to find out more about your ancestors, learn who they were, and find out whether or not they owned a coat of arms, please visit us at coadb.com, where we offer professional genealogy research services. Link in the description. Thank you very much.